All right, everyone, how are we all doing? Welcome along back to a brand new video. And today, we're looking for a rather beautiful animal, and that is the common kingfisher. The common kingfisher is one of the best looking birds in the UK and the only native kingfisher. A vibrant orange and blue, they can most often be seen flying low and fast over rivers and lakes. Being around 15 centimeters long with a wingspan of 25 centimeters, they're quite small, but they can offer up a loud high pitched call. They hunt small fish by perching on branches from overhanging trees and then diving headfirst into the water to catch their prey. Once caught, they'll perch up again and beat the catch against a branch before swallowing it. I'm joined by this handsome, lovely, long-haired beauty of a man. This is Ed. That is me, indeed. <laughs> He's joining me today on the riverbank of Warwickshire as we uh, set up waiting for Kingfisher over in that direction. We've already been here about half an hour now. Are you are you warm? Yeah, I'm fine. Yeah, yeah. What you got on your head there, mate? What's that? I've got on your... a lovely animal anomaly's beanie. <laughs> I've got. Forget my hair. You got video as well. Yeah. Oh, what a geezer! Look at Look that. Rep him. him. He's kitted up, isn't he? Now I can't lie. This isn't looking very good, right? And the flow is a little bit too fast. But over in that direction, there's a little still bit. And I've been here before, and the kingfisher usually perches up on that tree. It's a nice overhanging branch. It sits there. It looks beautiful, we can get some footage, we can get some photos, and hopefully it will look great. It's currently eight o'clock in the morning. We'll give it a couple of hours. If it's not here, we'll go somewhere else, which is also beautiful, and we can have a drink. So that's great. <laughs> so the kingfisher has just gone whoosh, straight past. He didn't want to stay. He didn't want to hold, he didn't want to loiter, nothing. And there was absolutely no chance. Ed didn't even see it. No. Nope. We were too busy looking at a darling up there. <laughs> and then I looked down over to this direction and then this kingfisher just went whoosh, straight past. So Oh well, that's annoying. Before we get into chasing kingfishers around Leamington though, I have to say that this video is sponsored by BetterHelp. BetterHelp is the world's largest therapy service and it's 100% online. With BetterHelp, you can tap into a network of over 25,000 licensed and experienced therapists who can help you with a whole range of different issues. To get started, it's really straightforward. You head over to the BetterHelp website, you fill in a few questions, you set a few preferences, and then BetterHelp matches you with a therapist that will suit your needs. From there, you can talk to your therapist however you feel comfortable that could be text that could be a live chat that could be a phone call or it could be a video chat whatever makes you feel comfortable you can message your therapist at any time and you can also schedule in live sessions at a time that's convenient to you and if for whatever reason your therapist isn't the right fit for you you can change your therapist at no extra cost with better help you get the same professionalism and quality as you would expect from in office therapy except with better help you get a therapist that is custom picked just for you you also get more flexibility when it comes to scheduling and all of this at a more affordable price. Now, if you'd like to take charge of your mental health, you can head over to www.betterhelp.com forward slash wildlife with cookie to get yourself 10% off your first month. So after three and a half hours sat on the riverbank just for the kingfisher to zoom on past, we set off on a walk to try and find it instead. However, on this walk, we encountered something we weren't expecting at all. We basically walked from here just to here and as we got around the corner what happened mate sparrowhawk he's a proper nice looking sparrowhawk as well um we still got no luck on the kingfisher but yeah we'll take one of them that's all Definitely. that's always good to see you know I've just 
just seen two kingfishers and not filmed any of it. We've just walked on towards this bit which is called Guy's Cliff and we just stopped there to have a look around because it's a really great spot to have a look and then all of a sudden we hear this like kingfisher chirping Sweet. very very loud not one two kingfishers and there i can hear it again actually oh it's flying across the river across the river <gasps> oh he's, 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 he's still there he's still there he's still there we're on we're on the kingfisher's happening there's another one oh he's going there oh my god this is kingfisher mania there's two flipping heck the kingfishers split apart and went off in separate directions one went down that way one went that way as we've just seen through the excitement one is flying back across this way and then the other one which i can still hear actually can you hear it it's over that way yeah um it's flying down that way there are two making noise very high pitched noise i'm not sure if you would have caught that on the gopro but i'll try and get the best angle i can for you oh but i want it want it on this because it'll look wicked so what we're going to do we'll walk back this way follow the river back to the saxon mill we'll come over this way and down there because i feel like we That's might get a better chance there yeah, yeah. should we try that yeah all right let's do it let's see if we can get some kingfisher on film can you hear a call then there's another one calling, yeah. There's one right in here, but we can't actually see it. We've just we've just seen it again, but we can't see it now. God, this is so hard. Every time we get close and we spot it, they go. Like, and we're not even. I don't think we're spooking them so much. It's more. <sighs> they just don't want to be seen. You know what I mean? Right. Ed and I have split up. We're getting the absolute runaround from these kingfishers flipping neck they're just they're all over the place and we're trying so hard to get them but we go to one area they fly to another side we get to that side they fly back to the area we just were absolute nightmare but it's good fun chasing them i can't lie so the plan now is to walk together see he's on the other side of the trees is to walk together and if i see them they'll fly his way and if he sees them they'll fly my way that's the aim and hopefully we can just get anything on the camera because so far i don't think we've got anything but we've we've had a great time viewing them we've, <laughs> it's been so good but nothing to show for it and that's the frustrating part but it's okay now walking towards the river in the hope kingfisher puts on a display for the camera right we've got action um i just got the faintest glimpse of it on the camera before it dived i think it's just caught something and i lost it now ed on the other side is trying to photograph it or film it but he hasn't got a long lens oh i can see it oh my god i can see it i can see it, I can see it. flipping hell i've just missed it again ed saying he was bashing the fish off the branch i thought it caught something oh, this is a nightmare we need this camera over there this is so annoying. Right, I'm making my way back to Ed. Hopefully he's still got this kingfisher in his sights. Because we need it. We need it. Come on. Oh yes, look at that. Oh, finally. Mate, she's stunning. Yeah. I've literally, me and her have just been stood here looking at each other. Oh. That's worth it, isn't it? Yeah. That's what we came here to see, boss. Too right. Let's nice one. Mission complete. Flipping heck. She's just so chill. Yeah. She's so chill. Oh, yes, then. That Magical is, experience. honestly, Magical. it is absolutely. We're blessed right now. Honestly. That's so cringe of me, but we are. It like, is. it's just so wicked to see. Beautiful orange chest. 
you don't stripey know what back. Talk, what we're talking about until you actually get out there uh, and see it. And well, we've been looking since seven in the morning. It's yeah, ten past two. <laughs> We finally found one. Do you we're know what, filmed. as well, like we've seen it dive and catch a fish as well, but we're about 20 meters away and it's like just so chill, just hovering and waiting for another fish, probably. Do you, uh, should we go get a bed? I think we deserve to celebrate, definitely. So, go on, then. Congratulations, everyone, we've done it. <laughs> <laughs>